10th Anniversary Eyes Free Inclusive Science and Entrepreneurship Camp started on August 21 on the World Entrepreneurship Day and inaugurated by Mr. Mancho Ferrer Program Director of Rural Development Trust. The camp includes children with all sorts of special needs and was made truly accessible for all students. The keynote speech was delivered by Mr. Michael Hingson of Independence Science USA. So I went to the University of California at Irvine. I have a master's degree in physics from the University of California. What I wanted to say, though, in specific that relates to blindness and blind people, but I will connect it, is I noticed the term used a lot still today, blind and visually impaired. Visually impaired is a horrible term to use. Why? Because visually we're not different simply because we're blind and impaired, we're not impaired. Just because we don't see as well as other people, that does not make us impaired. Blind and low vision is a much more accurate term that people should use, just like people who happen to be deaf do not want to be called hard of hearing or hearing impaired, they want to be called hard of hearing. People who use wheelchairs don't want to be called mobility impaired, because we're not impaired, we don't need to be compared to other people who may do one thing better than we do or they think they do. Professor V. K. Demodaran, Mr. Dipendra Manocha, scientists Suthish Chandra Mishra and Mr. B. Srimavasa Rao IAS, the state project director of Samagra Shiksha spoke to the students. The highlight of the opening ceremony was the speech delivered by Aman Ahamd, a five-year-old student. He never learned traditional technologies and uses his computer for learning and by now he knows the spellings of thousands of words and calculations. And in my future, I want to be a pilot or a inventor. The first day session was conducted by scientist Suthish Chandra Mishra of the Indian Space Research Organization and children were excited to touch and feel the rockets and satellites. It goes like this one. Students visited the SK University AIC labs and also a parallel session on entrepreneurship for senior students took place at the Atal Incubation Center.